Today, I saw an explosive piece of news on Reddit. User underscore Rob Laughter underscore publicly accused Applebots of providing a comfy UI custom node called comfy UI underscore Vision, claiming that it is a Trojan horse. According to him, this custom node scans your browser data, including passwords, credit card information, and browsing history, and sends it all to the attacker via a webhook. As a victim, he believes that this stolen data has already been used, as he received notifications of malicious logins to several services about a week after installing this node. As I mentioned before, even though both are stable diffusion, I now prefer using Comfy UI over Web UI. One of the key reasons is that Comfy UI makes it easier to benefit from the open source community, with developers providing free plugins with new features almost daily. However, this incident serves as a reminder that there may be bad actors lurking in the open source community. The plugin in question integrates GPT-4 and Claude 3 into Comfy UI, which seems quite useful. It has five forks and 45 stars, indicating that many people have likely downloaded it. If you have installed it, check your files, Python libraries, and registry to confirm whether you have been attacked. If you have been attacked, here are the cleanup steps. 1. Use pip to remove the malicious package versions. 2. Locate and delete the corresponding files in the file system. 3. Check the mentioned registry entry and clean it up. 4. For extra security, run an antivirus scan. 5. The simplest step is to change any potentially compromised passwords. As for why this plugin is suspected of being malware, opening the requirements file reveals that it requires the installation of two specific wheel files, which is unusual. Normally, packages should be downloaded from official repositories. A user extracted and analyzed these wheel files, finding that the malicious program inside traverses all possible browsers, copies user data from the database, extracts passwords, and sends everything to the attacker. The threat intelligence site Virustotal.com has also confirmed the malicious nature of this file. Latest news. The Nullbulge Group has claimed responsibility for this attack. They are an anti-artificial intelligence organization and claim that their malware is running on many computers. So, how can we ensure safety when installing custom nodes in the future? Here are a few points to keep in mind. 1. Prefer using Comfy UI Manager for installations, as they perform some checks and will remove problematic plugins promptly. 2. Inspect the requirements file to ensure all dependencies are downloaded from official repositories. 3. Choose well-known authors or repositories. 4. If you have the capability, review the code. That's it for today's video. I hope everyone stays safe from viruses and malware. See you next time.